51. Rash made two saves as the Islanders came at him in waves. Bossy finishes it off. Here's off the backboards. Trache shot easily stopped by Rush. Rebound. Bourne. He gets it with his left toe. And Bossy banks it off the defenseman into the net. And the Islanders lead one to nothing. Let's take a look again as Trache slams away, as does Bourne. And Broughton standing in front of the net trying to help Rush as the puck deflects off his foot into the net. One to nothing, Island. Quickly, the play was made by Bob Nystrom. Nystrom has been showing more lately, getting ready for the playoffs. Let's take a look. There's Morrow. He took the pass beautifully right on the stick from Nystrom, and he let that low shot. Let's watch Bob Nystrom as he avoids a check by Mahar. There he turns quickly, makes the pass to Morrow, and it's in the net. Morrow gets his fourth of the season. A fine low drive by Morrow. We talked about it, and I was pointing out, Jake, the fact that Longevin was up there his first shift, his first two shifts. The Islanders strike again. Bossy, Trache, Bourne. Here's Bossy as he pulls the puck around Rush. Look at the play by Rush. Poor play. Trache was checked from behind by Brumwell. The puck shot in front, deflected as Brumwell ties up Brian Trache in front of the net. Let's watch again. There's the play in front of the net by Bossy. Look at Brumwell all over Brian Trache. There's the shot by Bossy. Deflected into the net off the New Jersey Devils. Twice now in this hockey game, the first goal by Bossy culminates in Clark Gillies putting the puck in behind Glenn Resch, his 19th goal. Look at Dennis Potvin as he looks around and finds Gillies right there. Not a good goal for Resch. He was moving out, but it was just inside the goal post. Not a hard shot as we look again at the pass. Potvin to Gillies, his 19th goal of the season, has given the Islanders their four-goal lead, or I should say three-goal lead again, five to two.